Ever been stuck with a failed ATM withdrawal and a missing chunk of your hard-earned cash? Let's navigate the maze of ATM errors together and ensure your money finds its way back home. Number 1. How can I solve my ATM withdrawal problem? Here is the dreaded scenario. You swipe your card at the ATM, anticipation building for that sweet, sweet cash, only to be met with an error message and a sinking feeling in your stomach. First things first, breathe. Then, grab your Sherlock hat because it's time to gather clues, document everything the time of the transaction, the location of the ATM, and the error message displayed. This paper trail can be your best friend when you're trying to reclaim your funds. Next up, make that hotline bling. Your bank's hotline, that is. Contact the bank or ATM operator pronto. They've got the keys to this mystery. Inform them of the error, providing all the details you've diligently collected. They'll start the investigation process to track down what went wrong. Now, the waiting game begins. According to the Electronic Funds Transfer Act, your bank has 10 days to get to the bottom of this ATM conundrum. During this time, they'll be digging through logs, checking balances, and hopefully finding your lost funds. Stay patient, they're on the case. But wait, there's more. If you're still not satisfied or if things are dragging on longer than a Netflix series, it's time to bring out the big guns. File a complaint with the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau, CFPB. This watchdog exists for situations just like this, ensuring banks are playing fair and square. Your complaint can kick things into high gear and get those gears of justice turning. Number 2. What to do if ATM withdrawal is not successful? So, you've done the cash dance at the ATM, but the machine decided to sit this one out. No worries. According to the Reserve Bank of India RBI rules, if an ATM withdrawal fails but your account still takes the hit, there's a silver lining. Banks are obligated to automatically reverse the deducted amount within a maximum of T5 days. What's this T, you ask? It's a fancy way of saying the transaction day. So if your withdrawal flopped on a Monday T, you should expect your funds back by the following Monday plus five days T5. Banks are bound by these rules to ensure your money isn't playing hide and seek for too long. However, remember that banks are not infallible. Surprise, surprise. Sometimes things get a bit tangled in the digital realm and your money might take a scenic route back to your account. If the deadline is looming and your cash hasn't returned from its little adventure, don't hesitate to reach out to your bank. A gentle nudge can sometimes speed up the process. In the meantime, keep an eye on your account statements. Once that refund hits, you'll want to confirm it's back where it belongs. And hey, don't let this hiccup sour your ATM relationship. These machines are usually our friends in times of need, dispensing cash like a trusty companion. It's just sometimes they have a bad day too. Now that you've watched this video this far, I want to inform you that we are giving away a free $100 to one of you, our viewers, when we reach 1,000 subscribers. Subscribe to stand a chance to win. And as always, thanks for watching.